For those of you interested in traveling up to John O'Groats, this is where we stayed and we found it to be very comfortable. There were eight guests, eight guests even. <laughs> so I'm just going to show you some close-up photos of the actual caravan. We found it through Airbnb. This is the living room with an attached kitchen, so it's an open layout. It's a huge kitchen and a huge space. That's the master ensuite bedroom. That's again. And then there's two other smaller bedrooms like this one with a wardrobe. This is the outside of the actual caravan. There's a large sit-out area around the side of the caravan as well as the back of it. This is the entrance that you'll make your way into the Kobe's cabin caravan. This is the bathroom that the two other individual rooms have to uh, share between them. This is the ensuite in the master bedroom. Both of the other individual rooms have two individual beds like this, as well as a wardrobe. The other bedroom even had a dresser with a mirror, as you can see now. It's a huge space and it's a lovely um, caravan to rent out. So that's what you have to look out for on Airbnb. It's called Kobe's Cabin. Another huge plus and uh, a positive of staying here in this caravan park, uh, as well as in this caravan, is just this is the surrounding area, but it's literally a 10 minute walk from your caravan onto the beach. So I hope you have a great trip on your way to John O'Groats, whether you're cycling or just having a relaxed holiday. And I'll see you in the next video.